A pair of stoplights in Youngstown have been causing a lot of problems for drivers. The lights on the corner of Belmont and West Rand Avenues have been blinking red and yellow for several weeks. This morning, there was an accident at the intersection. Then a crew came out to repair the lights. 27 First News reporter Cameron O'Brien went back to the intersection this afternoon, and when she got there, the lights were blinking again. So she did some digging into the problem to find out how it's affecting people and drivers in the area. Cam is live in the studio with what she's learned. This morning, someone called the newsroom to complain about those lights on Rayan and Belmont Avenues. He said the lights had been a problem for a long time. So I went to the Youngstown Police Department to figure out just how long it's been an issue. They could only pull records for the past year for me, and I have them here in my hand. Since August of 2016, police have received more than 13 calls about these lights being out of commission. Alfreda Martin owns Frida's on the corner of Rayan and Belmont. She says the lights at this intersection have been flashing for weeks. It was only a matter of time before someone got into an accident. It's, it's a dangerous spot, and it should have been fixed a long time ago. The city's public works department says stoplight issues like this are relatively normal. You know, the city of Youngstown has about 220 signalized intersections in the city, and uh, it's not unusual for this type of thing to happen. Sometimes it takes a little bit of time to troubleshoot it and find the problem. Alfreda says she's seen the traffic department out here before. They flip a switch and the lights start to work again, but not for long. Like one day I know it was fixed, but the very next time I came around and through that, it was back doing the same thing all over again. The traffic department stayed to investigate the control box for the lights after this morning's crash. Chuck says they seem to have found the root of the problem. Um, so we're going to you know, try to trace down. It looks like there might be some type of short. Uh, they did find a bird's nest in uh, one of the one in the pole. Alfreda says public works needs to solve the problem fast. It should be done immediately because it's a dangerous corner. Like I said, it's a blind spot and it should be done immediately. The Public Works Department says it should have the problem fixed by this week or at the latest the middle of next week. Until then, if you're crossing that intersection and the lights are flashing, be sure to follow traffic protocol. Flashing yellow means proceed with caution and flashing red means treat the intersection as a four-way stop. In the studio, Cameron O'Brien, WKBN 27 First News.